Oh my God, guess what guys? I was sitting here on my couch watching TV, just minding my business, minding my business, cause you know how they go. But then I started to get this song by the Van Draws featuring Beyonce. I'm not sure if you guys have ever heard it. The closer I get to you, I kept, that song just popped in my head. So I was like, let me go ahead and play this. The closer I get to you, the more you make me see by giving me all you got. Your love has captured me. Yes, that song. That's the song I'm talking about. Do y'all remember that song? Then I thought about it. You know, spirit works through songs too. Letting me know that spirit is really trying to come in and show a lot of us that, you know, love is good. We should definitely give love a try. It's time for us to open up. And so I feel like for a lot of us, there's going to be some type of advancement when it comes to love. somebody's want to come towards you with some type of advancement or it could be somebody that you're already talking to but what I was picking up was this person is getting ready to come out and let you know that they're ready to move forward y'all know that part your love has captured this person your love has captured this person to the most depths this person may have thought they did not want love at first they did not want to be in some, any type of commitment but now this person is definitely ready they've been around you and starting to feel how you are feeling towards them or this might be you changing your mind and ready to go forward with more of a relationship so spirit is wanting you to know that it's all going to turn out for you everything's going to turn out for your good stop fighting love what you fighting love for if I, love is good it's always good to open up with love I know for me, I have been like, no, I'm good, you know, because I have a lot going. Um, I'm a busy woman. I'm a business woman, of course. When we open up to different situations, especially those that challenges us, because of course, a lot of us have went through relationships where it was, you know, hurtful. We were hurt. We were afraid of getting hurt again. So it basically holds us back and spirit is one of heal our broken hearts and heal us from that so that we can cleanse and be pure from that. And it's going to be time. I'm telling you, once this person comes in and approaches you, you're going to be ready. You're going to have to be ready. So get ready for your new circumstance, your new love, someone who's going to be coming in and letting you know that, look, it's time. I'm ready for you. I've been sitting here wondering to myself, why do I keep running from love? Why? Do, why am I? What is it that I'm so scared of? It's the fear of being hurt again. And you know that fear is not of God. So if you're the same way that I've been for a couple of probably like a year or so <laughs> probably more than that <laughs> but look if you're afraid to open up to other people honey it's like i i get it i get it but it's it's something about being healed and learning how to love we see different relationships and sometimes we run from it especially being the person that i am i talk to many people who have relationship problems and i'm i see it all the time and i think that's what runs me away because i've been through it but then i'm still seeing other people still going through the same thing i don't went through before and they still in a relationship i'm like girl i'm good i don't feel like dealing with all that because especially when you know you have other priorities that you got to take care of you're gonna run from it but this here this person's gonna come in and really be rushing in towards you so you might as well get ready to rush in with them it's going to be someone who's going to be very very um it's like i said this person is already at a point to where they're like look i don't know if i want a relationship for this like i said this could be you you didn't want the relationship but now you're like okay it just makes you overthink but i understand that look um you're going to need to allow your feelings to show allow these emotions to come out and open up to someone that you may feel like you want to be with even if look i remember somebody telling me they wanted to be in a relationship but they never go out i'm like look i heard somebody say i don't even know where this came from but i heard it on some something what you expect this person to just jump through your window or jump through your door talking about hey you want to go out on a date they're not finna do all that they're not finna just come to your door i hope not unless they're Look, unless they're weird. Look, but ain't nobody finna do all that. You gotta get out and put yourself, get ready to mingle, baby, mingle. See, I'm the type of person who will tell everybody who's in a relationship, if your relationship is good and y'all just having these little ups and downs, you might as well stay in a relationship. But I be like the main one, y'all. I be the main one ready to leave when it's time for me to be in a relationship like that. But I feel like other people have a calling to be in relationships. It has to be a part of your purpose to be in a commitment, to be in a marriage because it's a ministry all by itself. Some people are called to that and some people are not. Think about with Paul. Um, Paul said right here in 1 Corinthians 7, it tells you now to the unmarried and the widows, I say it is good for them to stay unmarried as I am. But if they cannot control themselves, they should marry for it is better to be married than to burn with passion. 
So <laughs> come on now. If he's basically saying, look, it's people need to get married if they can control their passions and their, you know, drive, their sex drive or whatever. You know what I'm saying? If you can't do all that and you need these people, you need someone in your life like that, it's better for you to be married than to burn with passion and then, than to be like lusting over other people or lusting over uh, an individual. You might as well get married to them so you can not burn with passion. <laughs> but y'all know for a fact. These days, people can't even control themselves even being married. We already know that. That's why it's so, the divorce rate is so high today, like for real. So what you gonna do about this, boo? What you gonna do when they approach you? Type in the comments what you gonna do when this person approaches you and lets you know that, look, I'm ready. What you gonna do? Type in the comments and let me know. Y'all know that song and say, if you ask me, I'm ready. Whoa, whoa. Are you ready? I don't know. Look, I, I told y'all about me. I ain't sure. Y'all type in the comments what y'all feel about the situation. This situation is just really popping up even on our timelines every day it's like i see when i'm on youtube i'm scrolling through or whatever and i'm seeing like look people talking about your marriage your kingdom husband is coming your kingdom wife is coming i'm like boo let me keep scrolling <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't be scrolling, but hey, I'm just saying it keeps popping up. So what will you do when it's time? Because a lot of you chosen ones know that it's time, you know, it's, it's coming. It's going to come. They coming. They coming. I'm telling you. So you might well be ready. All right, guys, that's all I wanted to do was come in and let you guys know I had that song on my heart. It just came through. Spirit was like, look, let's do a message. But I just want to know, like, look, let me know if you guys are ready for this relationship status this situation to come in hand are you prepared have you been preparing if you've been preparing how long you've been preparing i ain't been preparing for nothing y'all none of that not that part anyway but hey i'm just letting it be known but anyway listen it's <laughs> this is the end of the message if you guys would like to reach out to me for any of my sessions i do have i am running a huge sale this month so make sure you guys check that out in the description bar below um peace love and light i love you guys make sure you like comment and subscribe peace Go and get this song off of iTunes. It is written and sung by yours truly. Be sure to check it out and go over to iTunes and download this song and stream it. Thanks in advance.